we will see the riders. Sarah Shepstrand riding Bertram. It's a 19 year old gelding from Bernstein Leopard. And they are riding the test for riders under 25 years old. It's a special made Grand Prix test. Extended trot where we want to see. It's to be fluent, self carriage, over tracking. And there she starts rather well. In trot, we have half passes to left and right, so called zigzag. Again, looking at the fluency and also when they are turning from one side to another, look that they are bent the same way. First passage. Do it with cadence. Could be a little bit more collected, more underneath. But the cuff rather good with good activity. Sometimes small problems when he should be go with more self carriage, but in between when he's light and it works. For me, the passage is going a little bit too much forward. Good activity in the Piaf. In the transition, he is pushing away a little bit too much. An extended walk, relaxed, but at the same time marching. And you can see he's stretching his neck. He wants to go forward. So that was an extended walk for an eight. Collective walk, and we don't want to see so much over tracking, but lively, and the horse should be raised and arched. So the head position is quite different from the extended. Extended canter, also in a good way. And I think it's nice to see a 19-year-old horse that still wants to go. And you see that he likes to go. Half passing canter. The horse should look in the direction where it's going and then be almost parallel with the hind part. Should be parallel with the long side. Pirouettes should inside hind leg should be more or less on the spot. S still keep the canter, and they are allowed to slow down a little. Two tempo changes. We look for good quality of canter, but we also look at the straightness. And here he was swinging, especially to the left, and the back part was swinging and that's about 6.5 and half pass okay and now collect to to prepare for the period that should can look lo be a little bit slower but still jumping behind so I found this period a little bit better than the first one. And one tempis. From this position, he's 
possibly a bit shorter strides at the end. And maybe those the judges were going from behind thought it was a little bit swinging behind, but good rhythm, could be more cadence. But in the last path he was a little bit tired and tried to get more weight on the four legs. And for a good path, we want them to carry more weight on the high legs.